and his mate came over and he said, I asked him what he does for a living and he said, pirate. No. <laughs> what? I drink vodka lemonade and then sometimes if I've been on a booze for two days, I'll have vodka apple juice so to try and get me five a day in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what does she think fairies do? Well, she has um, doors on her skirting boards. Right. For them to come in and out and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off. No, no, no. <laughs> no way. Well, that's the cutoff point for you. It's yeah, three yeah. days of blood. Yeah, well, I've got a day off on Tuesday, so I might as well sit in Haney. <laughs> Have some off. poor nurse look at me hoop. <laughs> I was from Adelaide, and the closest city to drive to, is if you didn't fly, uh, it was Melbourne. That's a nine-hour drive. Oh, fuck. Fucking hell. It's big, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The greatest gay man of all time. <laughs> Tony is, Tony's <laughs> doubling down. Yeah, he can double down on me, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Just to clarify, no, no. we're calling Lewis Hamilton gay. You've heard that he had first exclusively on Hot Water's Green Room podcast. Lewis Hamilton, breaking news, is gay. And do you know why? Because when I kiss him, he closes his eyes. I like going um, Bowser. Bowser. Reminds me of myself, you know, big back. <laughs> angry big sometimes. Back. And, 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 and he kidnaps women. <laughs> 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 Jamie, I'm sorry, but you're a fucking spade. <laughs> 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 That's the best thing I've ever heard. Oh, God. Uh, That's okay. horrible. Yeah. Uh, funny, though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's happening, everyone? Uh, thanks for downloading Hot Water's Green Room podcast. Before we kick off with today's fantastic episode, I just want to let you know how you can support the podcast. You can join up. Uh, as a YouTube member at Hot, Wo- Hot Water Comedy on YouTube, sign up to be a podcast member for £3 a month. You get early access to the public episodes and a bonus episode each week. Not only that, you'll get access to all of the podcasts that are coming on the Hot Water Podcast Community Channel. It's going to be the place to come for podcasts in the Northwest. I hope you enjoy the episode. Thank you. <laughs> Am I into it? Yeah, yeah. Oh, We've got to change yes. it up now and then. Change it up when you're fucked. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, hello. Thank you for downloading, <clears throat> tuning in. It's a brand new episode of Hot Water's Green Room Pod. Got it right that time. Me, Jamie Hutchinson, and to my right. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm Tony Callum. You already know that, though, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> And we've got a fantastic guest, one of the best comedians in the country, Mr. Thomas Green. Hey! Uh, How you going? Uh, thanks See your left, down, by mate. the way, just to clarify, I'm yes. on your left. I'm not a good so comedian. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not one of the best in the country. Because it goes without saying. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus. Yeah. Thank you for coming yeah. on, all, mate. Thanks, yeah. mate. Thanks appreciate it. Doing. Appreciate it. Thank you. How are we doing? Yeah, good. Yeah. Yeah, doing all right, mate. What, what was this weekend? Uh, the Frog. Frog, nice. Yeah, Manchester. That's your, your crib, That's isn't his it? home. Yeah. That's his home, home, isn't it? Yeah, man. Um, is the roof being fixed? <laughs> <laughs> Since he was last on. <laughs> <laughs> Did nah, you? I saw his fucking sofa in the alley. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 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 Jamie's not in. Oh, fuck, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mate, it's a fucking rough part of town, that sofa as well. Um, <laughs> did you do the matinee show? I'm yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Fuck it, that's one of my favourite gigs in the country, mate. Five o'clock shows of the future, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The fuck is like that good, yeah? Like, yeah. I thought, I thought, I thought the, late, the later it is, it's the better it is. Nah, I think the... more pissed on her. Yeah, I think the two pissed. I'm not in a, you know, rowdy way yeah, at that Mary. time. Just tired... Joe at uh, 11 o'clock, I mean, yeah, if you're yeah, doing oh, a yeah, late, yeah. late show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're just knackered, and it's, they're just in, like, oh, fucking... But people are starting their night at the mat now. That's what I mean, and yeah, they're just they're in like, good yes, spirits. Let's and go. There's yeah. loads of optimism, so you can say any old shite, and it just fucking flies, mate. Yeah, so easy. <laughs> uh, not to take and away what I'm sure you did. Real but... short trip for you back home, yeah. isn't it? <laughs> 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 <Just> fall over. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'll be taking pictures near the bins. <laughs> Just don't wake me up. Oh. I've had a... Uh, I got a, oh, I got a fucking way with one on Saturday, mate. This is perfect. So I'm fucked. I've been on holiday for four days, Monday to... Where'd you go for holiday? Isle of Man. For holiday? Well, gigs. Isle of Man. Yeah. But like, mate, I'm Australian, and I know <laughs> that that is not a good place. <laughs> oh, mate, it's fucking the best place on earth. Is it? It's just an island of fucking freaks, and they're just my people. <laughs> <laughs> They're fucking. You, oh. is it, was it like Madagascar? Yeah, yeah, you became yeah. the King Julian. <laughs> <laughs> mate, I'm the I'm the Prince of Isle of Man, mate. Well, they all like you. Yeah, an island full of Jamie Hutchinsons. At the balls, right? So we fly over. <laughs> I'm fucking volleyed from the night. I was in the casino till six. Luckily, it was after it was an afternoon flight. I'm absolutely twatted. I've got like four hundred quid in my pocket. Don't remember winning. Or losing, I could have been down. Do you know what I mean? I just I had four hundred quid cash, so but no memory of it. Just I find you so fascinating. Yeah, just fucked. Just, just, just I had four hundred quid in my pocket. No, like, I don't know if I won it or lost it or robbed someone. <laughs> yeah, I, don't know. I just don't know. It's like I had four hundred pounds was the bottom line, but I don't know what the because I didn't check my internet banking because it, it's. It's just too much bad news can happen. Do you know yeah, what I mean? Right. So I just kept it that I'd won for the positive mindset because I've got gigs to do. I need to stay professional. I'm fucking dying, right? So <laughs> just get to there, but you're going away, so you have a pint, don't you? Yeah. Do you know what I mean? It's yeah, a 40-minute 40 40 minute flight. <laughs> 20 <laughs> minute, literally like a fucking half an hour flight. And uh, we're getting, we get, he said, like, this fella's picking us up. He's, yeah. he's, uh, he's just come out for fraud like seven years of fraud all the gigs are run by ex-criminals and that is fucking class oh yeah yeah dead sound fellas not like you know not proper crim- just fraud and that which yeah. you can you know victimless. not proper crims well it's victimless crime fraud isn't it <laughs> depends who you're frauding isn't it <laughs> it's a 19 year old woman then it's fucking bad isn't it oh, sh- oh, fucking hell it's only got a couple of years left <laughs> And she gets some fucking double glazing. With a fraud, but the tickets are like Manchester's biggest comic ever, and you walk out. <laughs> <laughs> Have you got a sofa? <laughs> <laughs> so we get picked up by this fella, right? And he's like uh, an Essex wide boy sort of thing. Yeah, he's yeah. like in his 50s, called Keith. You know, he's one of those people who's not allowed to go back to Essex again, because yeah. he'll get shot or something. Oh. Yeah, it's like right. three-piece suit, fucking gold tooth. Bit like fine, oh yeah, fine, you know, giving it all that. Yeah. So I'm like, you know, yeah, man, yeah, I'm trying to, because <laughs> I'm, I'm pretty intimidated by this guy, right? So I'm trying to act hard. So you know, like, if yeah. you see, I always act hard past teenagers. Yeah, try to walk with like a fucking stern face and stuff and stuff, so they don't pick on me. Right, like okay. a defense mechanism. Yeah, yeah. That one on does Goldfish. it work? Does it work? Yeah, I've never been picked on. <laughs> Like, I don't know. I don't know if it's because <laughs> you look hard or they're just scared. <laughs> yeah, I think or, it's the latter. Or, or they look like I've got nothing to rub. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, I do the puffer fish, so you just like oh, fucking walk moody and pretend to have like an angry phone conversation sometimes. So like you can just go, you fucking what, mate? Nah, I need it now, though, don't I? Yeah, and you just you just put on the image puffer fish, puffer fish tactic. It's you know survival of the fittest in town. <laughs> anyway, this wide boy picks me up, so I'm acting hard and that. Yeah, and we drive, and he's like proper like fatty, you know, he's a bit of a you know cocksure of himself. Yeah, yeah. We drive over this bridge, and he goes, "Hello, fairies." Starts so looking around. I'm looking at well, what the fuck has he just said? <laughs> Am I going under there? Has he just said hello to some fairies? And he looks at me and he goes, you need to say hello to the fairies. <laughs> what? What? I went, what? And he went, nah, seriously, you need to say fucking hello to the fairies. So I'm like, hello, oh, fairies. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, <laughs> did you look out the window? Like, where did he look? Above or below? He, he, he went like that. So, yeah, he was, he, he was kept his eyes on the road and he, he like, looked round and he said, hello, fairies. And then he so I went, Fucking mid conversation, yeah. just cut me off with that. I thought, you know, he's a fucking Ed, Ed case, this Yeah, part. yeah. Um, and then you went, hello, fairies. And I went, oh, oh fairies. Uh, <laughs> so there's a 
you'll find this because you're going Isle of Man soon. Yeah, uh, supporting Adam Rove. Yeah, on, yeah, on tour, right? So you'll find this if you go over. There's a certain bridge in Isle of Man, and if you cross it, you've got to bless the fairies or be polite to the fairies, or what? bad stuff happens to you. What? <laughs> Mate, so he was genuinely worried that if you didn't sell <laughs> other theories, you'd yeah, have bad luck or something. Yeah, like the car would crash or whatever. Fucking, how ruthless is Tinkerbell when he's all a man? He's <laughs> <laughs> writing people's cars off. <laughs> <don't know. laughs> why is me saying I why, why is me chatting up there he's going to stop your car from crashing? Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Does it on the way back as well. So our taxi back, fucking, what was it? Six o'clock, we had to get the taxi. Yeah. I was in the pub at half four still. Absolutely fucking cross eyed. Yeah. And in the taxi, and the taxi driver's like, say bye to the fairies. So I'm like, mate, just fucking get me to this airport, lad. I'd, and he was, he was adamant you had to say bye. Like, bye, fairies. <laughs> and wave. So you're going to have to say that on the bridge, man. You're going to have to say hello to the fairies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you didn't say it on the way back. I did. Oh, you did? Yeah, because he. Was, I thought you were like, yeah, no, yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, but he was. He was like the the fucking adamant about it. Yeah, do you know what I mean? What ha, what started the fairy thing? Did you find out? Oh fuck no! I don't know the fucking tap, mate. The class people they're just fucking at the balls. But <laughs> I've got, I've got an auntie who believes in fairies and elves and stuff, and on her skirting boards. So I'm kind of used to, you know, the etiquette of it. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> do you like if someone's I honestly don't, don't know what you mean. Fairy etiquette. <laughs> You're used to fairy <laughs> etiquette. What? <laughs> is there like a list of rules on how you're meant to engage with <laughs> fairies? No, I mean just like you know, <laughs> you know, not not um, discriminating people what? who believe in it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Do you know what I mean, oh, it's really? like my auntie believes in it, and it's obviously bullshit. But you've got to just, you know. Not it's upset like, them. Why, why would I upset her? Like, you get to get on with it. I'll just, you know, sing to your tune for a bit. I don't really what, care. What does she think fairies do? Well, she has um, doors on her skirting boards. Right. For them to come in and out and stuff. <laughs> uh, <laughs> fuck off. No, no, no. <laughs> no way. I swear no. no. She has, what, little fucking mouse doors? Like <laughs> yeah, Tom, Tom and Jerry. Jerry yeah. No yeah. way. There's no way. 100% mate. What, what, she, what? Has, she has a door on the skirting board. And um, <laughs> like dream catchers all over. It's like quite spiritual, things like that. Fucking yeah. She's, uh, a little bitch. Proper like, Joe tries to re- read your moon charts, all that kind of bollocks, <laughs> you know what I mean? She just needs sectioning then. <laughs> Well, maybe she goes out. You know, she's married into. Do you know what, As long as she's family. happy, isn't it? Yeah, that's what I mean. You among married. the fairies are happy too. Yeah, yeah. You know? Hello, fairies. <laughs> she, she <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> so, get to the gig, right? Every Isle of the Man native. So, there's obviously people who've done crimes and they're trying to escape and they're on there. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Was there anyone else there on holiday? Uh, was it? Just it's like you, you, it's like a. Blackpool sort of place right. where you know go for a weekend. Where it's, it's always is he different laws people. then? So does that way criminals go over there? Or yeah, there's lo- loads of tax breaks and that. Always the, yeah. yeah, a lot yeah, like yeah. Guernsey. Yeah, sort of like that. Okay. Yeah, so a, a bit of a theory is if you start your tour in Isle of Man, you get like tax breaks because you can do some for ticket sales or whatever. <laughs> So is that why Adam Rose over there? <laughs> <laughs> no, if you, it's only if you start it there, though. Oh, right. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what that is. I don't understand accountancy fraud. I don't get it. So yeah, I'm looking forward to my tour next year. <laughs> 20 days tonight, love man. <laughs> He's just still trying to claim his bed. That's <laughs> <laughs> an expense. Yeah. Do you know what my show is going to be called, don't you? Go on. I love fairies. <laughs> I love fairies. Yeah, yeah that's Sell out. Well, yeah. Right? I've got a good name for a show here. Or just right. Hello Fairies. Hello Fairies. <laughs> Hello Fairies. <laughs> it's Jamie. Yeah, it? yeah. And do one on Canal Street in Manchester. Joking. <laughs> 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 oh, Jamie. No, I'm joking. You know, I love you guys. Um, so, uh, yeah. So I get to the... Every Isle of Man native, you'll be able to tell them, uh, apart from people who have moved there, is their eyes are close together. So their eyes are, you know, like Paul Smith's eyes, are dead narrow, yeah. like that. People say you shouldn't trust people like that, shouldn't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah. Are you saying that he's actually from Isle of Man? Maybe. And he's, he's understood Maybe. trustworthy as well. Yeah. Or conceived there, I don't know. But it's in the it's in the atmosphere. Okay. Yeah, so... Do you reckon that's why they can see fairies? Because they've got <laughs> such, 
fuck's sake, you know, Chernobyl. <laughs> Tunnel vision. Yeah. They could just see. <laughs> fuck, I can. What it is, you know, like Chernobyl. Or like, yeah, it's Chernobyl. People were born like years after it, you know, with all like different. Uh, yeah. um, what's it called? What are they called? You know, the forms. The forms, yeah, yeah. So, like, something happened in Isle of Man. Definitely. What happened in Isle of Man? Well, if it's old, you'd have to kill you. <laughs> and uh, yeah, there's something happened in Isle of Man, and everyone's eyes are just dead smaller. Close together. Yeah, it's dead and that, they're like, you know, on the other side of the nose. Do you know what I mean? Right. Uh, anyway, so I, t- I turn up to this gig, and the fella running it, you know, cross eyed fucking uh, Neil, um, he, he's a former fraudster as well. He did. Yeah, how do you know everyone's a fraudster? They're just open about it. Really? Yeah, they don't give a fuck. Oh, okay. Yeah, he, uh, he used to match fix snooker games. <laughs> did he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Must be a good snook player, you know, because they can see the pocket. That is that subtle vision. Like. <laughs> I just love how <laughs> the entire time he's talking about how fucking crazy these people are. But you started off the story by saying they were my people. <laughs> yeah, they are. Yeah, you fucking love hey, it. Listen, I'm not above him. <laughs> <laughs> You're taking inspiration from him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're gonna retire there. Yeah, they love yeah but you made out you were like, you know, I don't know if you said frozen, but the fucking the guys match fixing snooker. Yeah, well, um, well what that's a boring in, life. That's in my family, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, it I told is. You, yeah, I told yeah, you about yeah, yeah, my yeah. granddad uh, match fixed a dog race in like, the oh. early nineties. Well, he, the dog was losing, so his mate ran onto the dog track and said, "Like animal rights, animal rights," to get the race voided, so they got a refund on their bet. Oh so, shit! So I'm in the match fixing. I'm in the you in know your blood. I'm in the gene pool. I've got in a the, fairy auntie. She married into us though, so I don't think she's part of the gene pool. But it's definitely there. <laughs> anyway, so I turn up to this gig in a cafe. In the Isle of Man, right? Yeah. Dead nice cafe, you know, proper arty type place. Yeah, yeah. Nice room for stand up and everything. And uh the fellas there and I was just talking to him and I just went, Oh yeah, he's a he's a bit of a rat. And he, he just out and just mid having a proper conversation with him, just shooting the shit. And I went, oh yeah, fucking rat behaviour or something. I said rat anyway. And as I said rat, this fella goes, <laughs> hops on one leg, starts pointing in the air like he's fucking dancing. He goes, <laughs> <laughs> you're not allowed to say rat over there. Why was you doing that? Because <laughs> that gets rid of the curse. <laughs> I can't be arsed. That's a god lad. Why? Swear to God. Why, is it? Why is he doing that on one leg? Hops on one leg. Why don't you say you can't say that over here, you know? No, hops on one leg, spins around and goes... <laughs> starts whistling. That's not the only thing you remembered from PE in high school, was that warm-up yeah. when you did it like... Yeah. Do you reckon you were just still fucking twatted and all this was just, you made this up in your head? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he was that fucked up, he fucking saw fairies. I that, because <sighs> rats sort of in my... Vernacular, or whatever. Do you know what I mean? So every time I say it, a local would whistle and do that. Like oh, point. Right. Was there any other words that they freaked out about? I don't know, but you've got to call rats long tails over there. Long tails. Yeah, long tail. Okay. I yeah. really want to go to Isle of Man. Yeah, right yeah, yeah, you yeah, are yeah. selling this, mate. To me. It's mint. So, so, <laughs> oh, it's <laughs> mint. Oh lad, I swear down right. So after every gig, we did a gig in Port Emin. Um, and oh, the local. What was the room? How, how many did you say? 40, 50. Is that so, it, yeah? Yeah, yeah. So we did three gigs in three different venues. Oh, we yeah. did a bit, of, a bit of a tour of Isle of Man. Oh, it's fucking class, mate. Are we putting that on your fucking what? comedy CV, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> no, <but laughs> you can't be doing that. You're all an end to it. 2022. <laughs> yeah, so, so you start off in Port Emin. Yeah. All right, you've got to get on these gigs, man. The fucking mint. I'm going, 100%. Um, uh, in a, like a, an art centre type cafe. So it's just... it's oh, just they've got, they got an art centre? Well, it's a cafe with, you know, serve nice food. So it's artistic. Do you know what I mean? Was there any art? Or was it you just like... They had pictures. It was just a cafe. They, <laughs> they had pictures. That art, you just called it stu- art studio. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's like, you know, they have coffees and... Oh, they have coffee? Really? Oh, do you know what I mean, though? Yeah, no. The just, centre of art. You know, wooden floor and... So quite so clean. a building. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, the sofa in the alley is fitting perfectly. Oh, yeah, right. it is. What's the word? Like, sort of... I want to see your coffees in Manchester, actually. You know, like poached eggs and coffee and, hey, we're going to have some comedy on and whatever. Just <laughs> laid back, sort of hipsterish <laughs> sort of place. Okay. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. 
Definitely like a five star hygiene rating sort of place. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Avocado, so, no? Yeah, that's what yeah, I'm I mean. know. Yeah, oh, it's a bit more gentrified. Yeah, yeah, that's the word I'm looking for. Gentrified. <laughs> Thank you. But you can't say that over there. They do that. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Jamie. <laughs> right, so we do we do the first gig, and it's sound. It's like uh, there's no middle act. It's just MC, opener, break, yeah. headliner. So yeah, it's yeah. fucking pretty easy. Um, we get back to this pub called Quids In, and I swear to God, when I die, I, I and this is recorded now, I want uh, <laughs> an, an ashtray of my ashes behind the bar there. It's the fucking best place on earth. That's called Quids In? Yeah. So they have a turnstile. Yeah. You pay a quid to get in, and the drinks are just dirt cheap. How cheap are we talking? I got a round of double JD and Coke, uh, two pints, and it was less than a tenner. It was That's fucking good. unbelievable, mate. Class. Yeah. So you want it? Why do you want to be there then? It's just the atmosphere. It's just great. It's just it's grungy. It's you know it's a rough around the edges. Where everyone's so nice. It's just a great atmosphere. On the first night, <laughs> we're having a drink. Me, Freddie, and Ignacio Lopez. We're having a drink. And this this fellow comes up to us. Who's you know proper wannabe mank. <laughs> But he's from the Isle of Man, but he's trying to give himself a bit of edge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he's like, yeah, man, I'm I'm sucking the devil's dick and that, you know, I'm I'm, I'm in the corporate chain Wait, and all that. So I just go what? back again? Yeah, yeah. Suck on the devil's dick. That's what he referred having a job as. What? What does that mean? It's just like he's, he's, he's oh, like controlled by the man. The man, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? But I, was, <laughs> I, I thought he was being cartoon mank. Yeah, I went. Oh, whereabouts in Manchester? From you went. No, I'm from from Douglas and the Isle of Man. You know what I mean? And I was like, what are you putting on my voice for? <laughs> you know what I, mean? I was just burning my head out, mate. Yeah, but you were, you did the same thing to the Essex guy. <laughs> you were oh yeah. And then, then someone does it to you, like yeah. But I'm I'm I'm, 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 <laughs> I'm retelling an anecdote. You, you, it's fine if he was telling a story about me. It's fine to put on the voice, but that was his voice. He had like a Liam Gallagher haircut. He was like trying to swagger about. I was like, mate, come on, man. Um, and his <laughs> mate came over and he said, I asked him what he does for a living, and he said, pirate. No. <laughs> what? what robs people? <laughs> no, he just went. I'm a, I'm a. I'm a bit of a pirate. They call me the pirate. <laughs> so I went. All right, Sal, mate. And he just he won't go. He's probably got a dinghy in a pond. <laughs> 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 Say hello to the fairies. I saw. But he, he was just dressed normal. And the next night on karaoke night, oh, he God. came dressed in full pirate gear Fuck with me. a big Jerry Sadovich hat on. What's but that? What's Jerry Sadovich? Jerry Sadovich wore like a big tall top hat. Who's Jerry Sadovich? He was a com- comedian. Was he? Yeah. Pirate. He wears like a hat. Was he a pirate? I don't know if he was a pirate. I don't know. All oh, right. Um, fascinated by the side of man. How yeah. small, how close to his nose was his eye patch? <laughs> in the Isle of Man. He's just one like a cyclops. <laughs> <laughs> you can't see. Just bu- bumping and turning like that. <laughs> <laughs> so oh, the first night we had a lock in till 8 a.m. Yeah, absolutely fucking class, mate. Me and Ignacio had a massive fucking Barney. You know Ignacio Lopez, yeah. Well, Barney, like you had an oh, argument. Oh. Yeah, you but, argue with him. Yeah, heated. No was way. It, yeah? yeah, about the nine inch nails. <laughs> okay, because he said nine inch nails were more significantly cultural. More culturally significant, sorry, than the Stone Roses. I just saw my ass. So we had a bit of a heat argument. And it was, it was, you know, it was joking, joking. And then it was just because we were so pissed. We was over the breakfast ta- table with a pint from the pub. And we was <laughs> drinking it. We, we went to the pub to lay, lock in. Yeah. Fucking class. I've been shot. I was fucking steaming, mate. And then uh, we're... The pub's f- like five doors down. I would try to leave at five and forgot what my hotel was called. So I had to go back to the pub. <laughs> and then they had to walk me home because I didn't know what my pub was called. The hotel was called. Do you know what my pub was called? So I, I came in and went, I, 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 I forgot where I'm staying. Went, oh, we're having some more drinks. I went, oh, fuck it then, I'll stay here. 
So they dropped the owners, uh, Louise and Andy. Uh, Louise from Coventry, Andy. Oh, that's close together. Yeah. The native. Uh, we went for bre- we went for breakfast. So I went. Or oh, can I have a carry out from the pub for <laughs> breakfast? So I was on the Peronis eating fucking scram of all these nice families screaming at Ignafrio. Name it two songs, nine inch nails. I did enough then. It was like eight a.m. <laughs> front of loads of fucking <laughs> families. Yeah. yeah. Where was Freddie during all this? Oh, he tapped out at like three a.m. Did he? Yeah. So yeah. I went. I went bed at nine. Very stuck in my <laughs> Very stuck in my yeah. <laughs> uh, Not for the first time. Um, I, I, I accusation that. <laughs> <laughs> I went to bed at nine, and uh, we got up again straight back on it, and I was fucking. Uh, we was on it till like five the second day, and the third day I'm a shell of a man. Yeah, yeah. And I tried to order an orange off the guy because you get like most your drinks paid for and stuff. An orange? What is that? A bit of fruit? Yeah, like a J two O. Oh, I thought you meant you wanted to get an orange. Oh no, no, no. like I mean, half time. I like mean, fuck, I need, <laughs> I need <an> oranges. <laughs> <laughs> you got another forty five again. Uh, Got any chaffer cakes? <laughs> so I, uh, I tried to order a J two O off the guy, and he just came out with a pint. He went, "I am never buying you a soft drink." <laughs> so I didn't. Ha- I had, what? I had one. I had two coffees there in the mo- each morning, and all the rest was just everything out. else was booze. Did you have any water? No. Jesus Christ! No, I didn't have any water. That's the first water I've had in a week. Boring <laughs> water, though, isn't it? Looks like you're doing well as well with it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I got that. I got that in duty free. <laughs> <laughs> As soon as long you have water, it's tax free, yeah. So then, so you, how long was there for? Four days? Uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Yeah, flew yeah. back Friday. On Thank f- I've seen a photo of you yeah. on Friday at the airport. Oh, Jesus Christ. Mate, on Thursday, I tried to go at 12 and I, I couldn't leave. Oh, God. Because I was, Freddie went at midnight because we had a taxi at six and Ignacio was, was still out and... He just looked at me as if to say, I've won. So I went I went out the turnstile and walked right back in and got another fucking round of shots in. I went, you've won, fuck all, mate. Paid so you, paid you quid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> got back in. Yeah. So I got back in. <laughs> and then Ignacio started making sangria because he's Spanish and that. So I was having it fucking well nice sangria. I was absolutely fucking lobbing it down. And it got to like half two, three o'clock, and I'm like, I'm not fucking going. Because in my head, this is, this is you know, two gorillas fighting now. <laughs> it's who survives at being Ignafio. At the pub? Yeah. Yeah. But then he So you thinking that whoever, like, taps out, yeah. like, you're a fucking pussy. Yeah. Do you, is this because... Joining the fairies on the hill. <laughs> <laughs> right. So who will then? Well, this is it. I think he cheated. Oh. Because he got a guitar off the wall to a music venue and just started playing Nine Inch Nails till I went. <laughs> so I, I That's amazing. Look, I can't That's do it anymore. I have, he deserves to win. I went, yeah, yeah, I tap yeah. out. I tap out. That's man. phenomenal. Yeah, I tap That's out. So I tapped out at three. <laughs> so I get, I get home. Four doors down, it takes me like 40 minutes to remember what hotel it is again. Yeah. Because they all look the same. They all got different. They all, they all got the same name, like Beachfront and Sea View, and it's all generic names. All just a big yeah, yeah, Pro Evo. So, yeah, so it's, it's all just a big Pro Evo, that's it. I don't remember names of places. I, I tried to get a hotel in Liverpool. Well, I was booked in the Premier Inn, and I was looking through my emails for Travel Lodge, and they wouldn't let me in because I was pissed. I just I hate Christ. hotel names. Um, so, uh, yeah, so I got in, like, four, and then I was kip, then got ready for the taxi yeah. at six. No sign of Ignacio banging on each other. Do you know what we need for you? Like, don't have dog tags, <laughs> <Yeah>. don't we? <laughs> I'll get chipped. If, yeah, if found, <laughs> please return to here. If please return to the sofa at the back of the frog. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, so, like, Ignacio's answering his phone. So Freddie went, God, you're going to have to knock up, knock on for him. So I'm banging on his door. I went, yeah, you might have won the fucking drinking, mate, but at least I'm going home. Enjoy the fucking Freddy, lad. And uh, we bell him, and he's still in the pub at six. So he goes in, just packs up, 
in the taxi. What a fucking hero. What a legend. Yeah. Shout wow. out Ignacio Lopez. Get on his comedy stuff, Comedy Lopez on social media. What a yeah, fucking yeah. guy. Yeah, yeah, I really yeah. need to meet this yeah, guy. Yeah, yeah, oh, he's yeah. great. Oh, he's he's good. good quality, yeah. He can do yeah. Sounds man. right up my seat. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a good laugh, man. Uh, so it was, it was a proper tactical warfare. So on, I've been, so I got back on Friday and I'd been uh, shitting for blood for a couple of days. So that's why I'm on the water now. Um, well, that's good that you're getting water back in you. Yeah, mate. yeah. Because well I don't. Water's not the cure for blood. Hey. Water's not the cure for blood. You need to go to hospital. I thought you were having a crack at me then. I was like, hang on. <laughs> He's the one <laughs> who needs help. <laughs> Lads, no. you need to go. Have you, need, have you been, been a doctor or a hospital? No, because no? there's part of me that thinks it might be the sangria. So I don't want to go to the doctor with sangria shit. No, wait, what you think? I, I think uh, it's, there's red. There's a lot of red. Fuck and you're not that. sure. But it could be sangria. And I'm not going to be one of don't those guys. Don't you think guys. it's best getting a check, though? Yeah. Nah, I'm not going to be one of those guys where they try to get a diagnosis for sangria. I'd rather die on my sword with pride. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> like a proper pirate from Isle of Man. Been to the man in, co- in the corner said, I love how Jamie thinks he's got pride. <laughs> <laughs> ah, so, yeah, enjoy Isle of Man, man. Yeah, well, I don't know how I'm going to cope because this sounds ballistic. Oh, yeah. Only one venue, though. I don't know what the venue is, but. Well, it's the big, it's the big theatre there, right? There's, they have like a you know a proper theatre, and I think he's yeah, Adam doesn't gig in cafes, <laughs> 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 art studios. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. So where was you this weekend? Then was you just in the frog? Yeah, just the frog. Just the frog and then yeah. Friday, uh, so went yeah. Start off Wednesday. I did uh, Stockport, and then came here. Yeah, and then uh, hot water. Was that Friday? Was it? That was Wednesday. Oh, Wednesday. And then Thursday, Friday, Saturday was the frog. And then I doubled on Friday with Bolton, the other frog gig. In, oh, yeah. In the axe throwing. Oh, yeah. I've heard mixed reviews about that. It's a bit oh, it was chaos, weird. but yeah, it was yeah. fun. Yeah, yeah, was yeah, yeah, yeah. Chaos. Yeah. Right. And then uh, well, I had, it was one of those ones when you're like, I'm up there. And I was like, right. They've all, oh, they told me like, it's a bit, it's a bit, you know, a bit leery. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And like, I felt like, all right, let's go. So they're like, <laughs> they need a bit of energy. I'm like, well, that's me. I'm fucking, you know, yeah, jumping yeah, up. Yeah. And then I go up, and then literally about five minutes from my set, I was like, there was a lady on her phone. She's just on her phone. There was a bloke when I was like, I anyone been to Australia? And the guy went, Steve Irwin. I'm like, are we just yelling out dead Australians yeah. now? Like, I'm that, expecting someone to be like, Shane Warren. Like, yeah. I was like, what is... <laughs> that famous Bolton wit there. <laughs> 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 then what blew my mind is there was this guy who like, and this lady, like the, the couple, they're facing, they're sat at a table facing the opposite direction. And their friends is taking photos of them with me in the background, just like, <laughs> oh are you God. fucking serious? Oh like, no. it's just crazy. But it was good fun though. And then, yeah, back there. For Did they go night. to the comedy club or were they just in the room and you doing comedy? No, it was, they bought tickets. It's fucking weird that, isn't it? Yeah, so yeah. weird. And then at one point, I, you know, mentioned them leaving and everyone cheered sort of thing. And they were getting up to leave. And they then went and hugged all of their friends that, Corresponding tables, like six. Oh, seven. just just to take the time to take take a piece. It was just like I was like, "Come on, Bolton, man!" But everyone else was on side, and yeah. it was great fun. It was like one of those rooms where you're just like, "This is good fun." Yeah. Like, I meant to do twenty. <coughs> so, were, so were they yeah, all like yeah. long tables, like beer color tables? Yeah. So I mean? it was like, oh, this is sort I of hate sat that man. So like the this. side on, yeah, side on, oh. but they were side on facing. Away, yeah, that's it. It just it encourages talking as well. Yeah, yeah it does, I hate yeah. that, and I hate booze as well. Joel and that little private booze. Yeah, you said the booze, back, yeah. then I was like, oh, no wonder. <laughs> I'm like, nah, yeah. four days on it, you shit and blood. <laughs> I love that he's come back from the Isle of Man. He goes, fuck, I'm shitting blood, and then he, last night you got on it again, and today you're hanging. No, I'm not Did hanging. You get it last to, night? Oh, no, I didn't drink last night. Oh, are yeah. you? Are you I'm feeling just, good I'm, right now? <laughs> 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 Oh, is this is this God. you good? When did I last feel good? This is good? your intervention, wow. by the way, Jamie. <laughs> wow, it must be three o two, o two, o three. This is your uh, this is your this is your this is your intervention. <laughs> you need to stop, Jamie. Was that the last time you'd had water? <laughs> was that, do you know I was hydrated back in o two o three around there. <laughs> oh, real. Yeah, man. Uh, no, I didn't drink. I didn't drink last night. Have you checked uh, your shit recently? Yeah, today. Oh, it was still red? Yeah. Fucking hell. 
It would be sad. I had a tandoori mixed grill last night as well, though, so that's all more red food colouring. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just gonna get. I'm just gonna, not going to eat anything red today. Okay. And then, and then, I've, then there's a fair judge. And then if there's blood tomorrow, you're going to go and get it checked out. Tuesday. Tuesday. Well, mm. that's the cutoff point for you. It's yeah, three yeah. days of blood. Yeah, well, I've got a day off on Tuesday, so <laughs> I might as well sit in any. <laughs> have some <laughs> poor nurse look at me hoop. <laughs> some poor nurse. I've never heard an asshole described as a hoop. hoop. Yeah. A hoop. So, yeah. Fucking hell. That's unreal, mate. Yeah, man. Look at you, like, fuck, I need to get this water in. Yeah, I only had one beer on Friday as well. Yeah, so I, mean, I was at Hot Water doing early and late show. Um, so I had, like, you know, went for just a quick drink in between shows. But I just had one beer. I was like, I'm fucking knackered here. I mean, I'm not even going to drink. I'm just going to fucking... But you can't turn down a free pint, can you? Say sober. Yeah. I don't think I'm... <clears throat> I tried to turn down a free pint there, the man. Is when, he said, when he said, like, when he ordered the J, so he went, I'm never get, giving you a soft drink, ever. Is it, do you have to stick to the same type of bevs? I mean, I know you no. have the sangria, but usually? No, I'm I'm, I'm mix and match. So do normally you? start off with lager, then if I have a shot, it'd be spice rum, usually. Okay. And shots, I'll probably go for black sambuca. Oh, I can't oh, do God. black sambuca. Yeah. No. I, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a vodka and tequila kind of guy. Oh, yeah. I, I'm bad with yeah, tequila. tequila. Yeah, yeah. Is I can that? put away some vodka, like. Can you? Yeah. Shots? A lot. I've never really no, done vodka. I, like, straight, I yeah. drink like, I drink vodka lemonade, and then sometimes if I've been on a booze for like two days, I'll have vodka apple juice, so to try and get me five a day in. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, vodka's got potato <laughs> in as well, hasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> vodka apple juice, and then, you know, yeah, it's, but, well, it's better than vodka lemonade, isn't it? Yeah. Have you ever had tequila and with pineapple? And you buy carbs on the way home. <laughs> you get yeah. Have you ever had tequila with pineapple juice? Yeah. That's really fucking nice, yeah. isn't it? I shot a shot tequila, gold tequila. Oh, is that the one with the worm? No, no, no. It's just a gold, it's the gold. Wait, what? A worm? The, in Mexico, they have worms in the tequila, don't they? Yeah, yeah. What's that for? Um, that? You meant to eat it or something? I don't know. I think it just adds to the flavour. Is, it, is it an, I think it's yeah. Like I think a dead it's a, worm. Yeah, is it a worm? Like, yeah, I think it's. it's uh, uh, What's it, what's is it, it hallucinogenic? Those? Like cause I was going to say before, oh, maybe. Like, with the fairies thing, because you know the absent fairies. I was wondering if, like, maybe they're just trying to what, what's like, release ab- their own. What's ab- an absent fairy? You know, have you ever seen Moulin Rouge when they all have absent and they see fairies? Yeah. Absent and hallucinogenic. There you go. That's so the w- there's the connection. The it's wormwood. Rotten wood. Yeah, rotten wood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fucking yeah. hell! I could make some absent for my. Bro, I've never seen Moulin Rouge. Like, oh, it's great. Yeah, yeah. they probably get tripped out on uh, absinthe. That's why I thought maybe. Maybe Isle of Man's about to release their own absinthe and they're trying to get That'd people... Be great marketing, that Is Moulin Rouge yeah. the one with the dancer on the bar? That's Coyote. Okay, that's that's coyote. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. What's Moulin Rouge then? Moulin Rouge is... Is it like a, is it like a, um, a, a theatre show? Is Ewan McGregor's... The, the, yeah, the theatre. Yeah, 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 yeah. And he's the writer and he falls in love when the burlesque dancers and then... Dust yeah. Till Dawn, they get fucked, don't they? Eh? Dust Till Dawn. Dust Till Dawn. Yeah. I love that film. I remember, it's I got I a great soundtrack as well. I only remember it vaguely. Dust they get fucked on there. Dust still done. Have you seen it? No. Nah, the vampires. That? Oh yeah. Nah, is it good? George Clooney. Really, really good. Yeah. Is it? Oh yeah. Classic. Are you into vampire movies? Yeah. Are ah, yeah. you? The Lost Boys. One of my favorite films of all time. Oh, I not seen that. What? Nah. <laughs> oh my god. I mean, you got to have a movie like <laughs> yeah, that. Yeah. <laughs> I think the only vampire movie I've seen is like Underworld. Those the series of Underworld. Oh yeah. No. No. The, the Lost Boys is a classic. Is it? Yeah. Okay. Keith Sutherland. Oh, it's right. really good with. I thought that was the one when they were all like, you're on the train tracks, they're all like... That's the, it. Is it? But it's not vampires. It is. I'll stand by me. Oh, stand by oh, me. Oh, me. me. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Lost, I was like, Did hell? you see the Lost Boys where they jump off the rail, like a, like a railway in, into like a, into a ditch? Like, but yeah. Stand by me is so immu- emotional. I was man. so confused and I was like, fuck me, I don't remember vampires and stand by me. Like, I was so... <laughs> that would be fucked up, that would <laughs> It's find a dead body. The yeah, vampire yeah. goes. Ah. I, I had a, I had a bit of a fantasy about finding a corpse after Stand by Me. Joker's. It? it it's not the dead body itself, but it's how the mates united. Do you know what yeah. I mean? Over it, I fucking mint. So you just need the friends. Yeah, I know dead body. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'll be happy. Have you seen what we do in the shadows? Who? Oh. Oh, it's a comedy. Uh, so it's great. 
you can watch. It's like a, it's a yeah, it's a British comedy. I don't watch comedy. It's like, no, I don't watch. <laughs> my, my, my only comedy it's film. Vampires though. Oh, is it? Yeah, that's oh, what I'm saying. Well, <laughs> <laughs> He's like, oh, I'm in. I'm in comedy oh, yeah, vampires. Oh, it's, it's fucking great. Vampires. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's sorry. It's maybe yeah, but it's got British actors in it. But but New Zealand is a yeah Kiwi. Yeah, uh, is it Ta- yeah, Taika Waititi's in? But yeah, nice. Yeah, yeah. Flight of the Co- yep. Yeah, yeah. It is Kiwi. But I didn't. I didn't want to give them credit, you know, because I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. That's their <laughs> island, man. It's Australia's <laughs> island. <man>. <laughs> 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 hey, obviously you're from Australia. Yeah. Yeah. What's the What's the the comedy scene like there? Very different. Is it? Yeah, yeah. Everything's so far apart. Oh yeah, it's you know what I mean? Like here, you know, I was in Manchester this morning. Yeah. I'm here in London an hour. Yeah, in Liverpool, and then I'm back there tonight. Do you know what I mean? It's like yeah, it's forty minute drive, isn't it? Yeah, it's nothing. And then yeah. you've got major clubs. You know what I mean? Whereas uh, Australia, like <laughs> I was from Adelaide, and the closest city to drive to, is, if you didn't fly, uh, it was Melbourne. That's a nine hour drive. Oh fuck, fuck it out! It's big, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's like from here to the Isle of Man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you swam it, yeah. yeah if you walked, <laughs> you let the ferry take you. Yeah, I'm going by ferry. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking I'm rat. Going by ferry. <laughs> like, do you mean ferry? No, no, no. I'm fucking I'm flying my ferry, mate. I'm, ferry. On a, I'm on a fucking budget. I'm playing cafes. <laughs> 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 is he is he comedy clubs in in, in Australia like in Melbourne and in the yeah 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 yeah, 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 yeah. he's got the yeah. big big clubs big he, clubs but, yeah but uh, I, I feel like obviously yeah it's there's, there's a circuit here I'd love I, I'd actually pay yeah I, and I'd be happy to pay you to see to send Jamie over to Australia to gig oh I'd be like oh, a mate, slug I would salt, love that I'll be I'd, I'd just put a GoPro on him to see <laughs> yeah, what he gets yeah yeah, yeah yeah. I would love that. I don't so think we should do that. I can't find an hotel four doors down. <laughs> How the fuck am I going to find a club nine hours away? <laughs> <laughs> oh, mate, imagine oh, the oh, fucking be, state you're getting over oh, there. I'd be fucking oh, gone, that's man. so funny. I reckon, I reckon you get arrested, 100%. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Probably. Oh, oh yeah, that's what I mean. Decent um, exposure, probably. It's good for festivals and that, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, festi- yeah. They build like the festival There's scene. There's more of a there. festival circuit. A lot of the uh, comics there, like. Uh, either get into TV or radio yeah, and then they do the festival run as well. That's usually how it works. So do you go back every year for the festivals? Uh, I have been. I'm not ne- this year and not next year. Oh, right, sorry. Um, but uh, yeah, you can't go back over because they've got Perth, Adelaide, uh, Melbourne, then people do Sydney and then sometimes people then at the end of that run then go into New, New Zealand. So yeah. are they all consecutively after each other? Yeah. All right, so... You'd go there for three or four months and then come back to England. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you ever oh, find a sense of humour is different then from here and there? Yeah. So, like, do you have to do you have to change your sets when you're back home to? Well, yeah. if I'm talking about anything Aussie, like obviously, like I don't have to like uh, explain yeah, certain yeah, things. Yeah, yeah. But I, mean, yeah. I feel like British and Australian humour, like we really get each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's true. Brits, yeah. Do, you guys would do so well over there. Like they love it. They love an accent. Do you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, and yeah. It's kind of the same here. Like people go, oh fuck, he's well, awesome. Yeah. Na- Neighbours and home and away are massive here. Do you know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. Like, because it, it's, they are similar. It's just fucking hot England, isn't it? Like, British yeah, love like, Ireland's massive yeah. over there. Yeah, and Aust- <laughs> everything Australian gets big over there. But, like, American soap operas don't really translate that well over here. Whereas yeah. Neighbours, I think, does. Do you know what I mean? Which is mental to me. I think it's because we, as in Britain and Australia, make such low budget soap <laughs> operas yeah I think that good yeah oh. <laughs> people just go yeah <laughs> rest in peace oh. Navies it's closing isn't it is it yeah no it's not yeah yeah wait hang on what the oh, fuck shit, is going I on I just brought the news here yeah. are you serious sorry mate yeah Ramsey yeah. Street's gone Ramsey Street Susan and Carl R.I.P do you watch it yeah. No, I used, <laughs> I used, I, I loved it back in the days. Did you ever watch it? Yeah, there was a so, stint where I watched it for maybe a year. Yeah, so like, um, you know, when Dan and Lucas Fitzgerald owned the, like, the bike shop, and no, there was no fighting, o- there was fighting over Steph. Right. Oh, Steph! I remember Steph. Yeah, Steph. yeah, yeah, yeah. Steph. She was uh, massive. Yeah, 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 yeah. Australia loved her. What big girl? Fits as fuck. Was she, yeah? Popular. Yeah, yeah. popular yeah, yeah. Like her. Oh, she was I massive just, in yeah, Australia. I thought she was really yeah, yeah. big, but big girl. <laughs> I'm not that much of a cunt. Oh, fuck, yeah, she's <laughs> huge. <Yeah. laughs> she was sort of like, do, do you remember 
Mal in EastEnders. <laughs> had real problems with her on set. <laughs> Fucking hell. Uh, tons, tons, tons. <laughs> 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 Steph, that's all a buffet again. <laughs> Steph, right, guys, wide lens, let's go. <laughs> going to have to go for a wide shot here. Sorry, Steph. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, that's horrible. Know. Yeah. Uh, funny, know. though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's sort of like uh, Tamton halfway over here, the turn of the millennium. <laughs> okay. Wait, what? Yeah. Uh, what? A character called Melanie Eastenders. Okay. So I watched the old Eastenders. I watched Night is Eastenders on the right. drama channel. Okay. Yeah, he's um, watched them all, and then now he watches them again. Yeah. yeah. Is it because you related so well to like so Max Brad? <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what I mean? <laughs> mate, don't mate. I I swear to God, good. I on. swear to God, listen to this. So. Do you ever watch EastEnders? No, no Fucking idea. Fucking hell, man. We're going to have to have a soap night. <laughs> <laughs> Movie night with me. Yeah, soap night with you. I'm going to come out. Vampires. <laughs> sorted. EastEnders. <laughs> I'm going to like, create my own comedy character of like a vampire chav. <laughs> <laughs> come on, it's like your fucking blood, bruv. <laughs> I go to uh, Isle of Man, they're like, oh, yeah, it's just Tom. Uh, <laughs> yeah. oh, Are you a local? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, so Max Brannan, uh, Stacey Slater was like the fucking fittest soap character oh, of all time. Was... I love her to bits. I, um, one of my first sort of, when I was getting into masturbating on a regular <laughs> basis, I, I I came all over in the inside soap. You what? in my mum's soap magazine, there was a double page spread of Stacey. Oh, and I came all over it. Oh, Jesus Christ! Yeah. I generally, for a second, just thought you meant and there then was like a soap. You right. came hey, all over that, a, that a is, bar of soap. That, oh, is, oh, no. that is one was looking to see what time neighbours was on, yeah. ripping the pages <laughs> together. No, oh, God. I, I bought her a new copy. I'm a gentleman. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hey. I'm, sh- I'm not a scumbag. I'm sh- also do the copy for Mother's Day. Um, <laughs> I'm chivalrous. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Uh, you know what? Every time it's just like you just—I don't know how you do it, but you become like more Jamie. Yeah. Do you know, oh, he saw me down the river the, the other week. Why? Me? Yeah. How's that? In thing? the Chinese? What? Do you remember the Chinese? The Chinese. I remember being there, to the yeah. Chinese restaurant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So before the starters came and everything, what did Adam say about you? What did you believe about wind? <laughs> you can't fly in wind or something. Oh. You fly above wind. Oh yeah. So what? So Adam, for on the second night of the tour, it was when that storm Eunice had hit. Oh yeah, yeah. And he was trying to work out how to get from Nottingham to Birmingham, and I was stuck in knots because I was meant to go on a stag do up in Edinburgh. And so we're trying to work it out, and he's like, "Oh, you know, the trains are cancelled. I'm going to have to get an Uber." I was like, "Mate, just." Just go to the East Mids Airport and fly. He's like, fly in a storm. <laughs> I was like, yeah, you can just go above it. <laughs> and he's like, yeah, but you're going to go through it, you dickhead. I'm like, yeah, but then you'll be a... Yeah, so yeah. that was that part. Yeah. And then what happened after that? So when I found out he was thick, you know, about... <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I went, oh, we're the same. Because that's the kind of thing I believe. And we had like a proper kinship moment. I was like, yes, no. We're on the same wavelength now. And 10 minutes later, I, I told him that I'm not allowed to toilet in my mum's toilet. Yeah. And he went, nah, I'm cutting ties with you. And just <laughs> sold me down the fucking <laughs> river. And then they all ganged up on me like yeah. jackals. Yeah. And I was just getting <laughs> slaughtered. <laughs> yeah, I was slaughtered. Even the thing, I was getting I was like, battered. There's no way. There's no way we're the same, Jamie. No, we are. But for mate. a moment, you were like, oh, that's what you believe about wind. I don't make... Uh, who, who uh, he just one time we're at the gym and he just goes, oh, do you, do you know people just randomly come out with stuff? He's <laughs> like, do you know, what do giraffes do <laughs> in like a really windy day? What do they do? Are they, are they all right? He's like, do their heads... <laughs> Or the leg. Oh, yeah. I feel like that's something you'd yeah, say. Yeah, you do think of just. Because look at that. I like how you were like, "What the fuck?" And Jamie's gone, "Yeah, fucking what, dude?" That's, that's all this. That's all this podcast is. Is yeah. him saying stuff and me going, "What the fuck?" <laughs> well, they've got. Well, have they've you, got do you know about this about these toilets? St- yeah, 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 yeah. They've got sturdy neck. What the? Oh, yeah. Oh, they're, so they're, we're so coming into this, are we? Okay. Yeah, because. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> they've, they've, 
evolutionary developed to cope with wind. Yeah. So it's not just it's not it's not stick it's not stick thin. They've got strong necks. They'd be good Formula no. One drivers. They could take the G force. They'd be good prostitutes as well. No, but they might hit the red on one of the advertising boards if they <laughs> stuck out. <laughs> that would be the most brutal, the most brutal fucking <laughs> sport in the world. Yeah, Giraffes. Yeah, yeah. yeah, Jerry's been decapitated, so <laughs> that's a five point disqualification. <laughs> <laughs> Safety car comes what would out. Be a good. F1 driver. I think something that, like compacts like a little mole. Oh, we took animals? Yeah. Oh, yeah As yeah, a yeah. good F1 driver. I, I automatically just go to like characters from like Mario. You oh, know, yeah. Got, like, a plumber. <laughs> <laughs> a plumber would be a great <laughs> F1 driver. <laughs> he's yeah. fixing his stuff as he's going along. <laughs> I've got a leak. Don't worry. This is old tires. <laughs> um, Turtle. What's, no, your, what's mm. Yoshi? Yoshi's good. Yoshi's like a dinosaur, isn't he? Yeah. Yeah, yeah but they don't exist, so. Oh, okay. <laughs> don't start. But fairies do. Fairies do, yeah. Fairies do. Oh, you oh a fairy in a Formula One car? Oh, yeah. Oh, no, oh, we've only got one Lewis Hamilton. <laughs> oh, pew, pew. What? See what I've done there? Wow. I call Lewis Hamilton yeah. gay. The, se- the seven-time <laughs> world champion. He's gay. The greatest Formula One driver of all time. The greatest Gay man of all time. <laughs> Tony is, Tony's doubling down. Yeah, he can double down on me, baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Um, are you into F1? I love it. Do you really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know, Have you seen the oh, new announcements yeah. in Vegas? Oh, oh my God. Yeah. Are you into it as well? Uh, yeah, a little bit. A oh, little, little bit. A little bit. Down oh, the strip. That, the, imagine going to see the F1 in fucking Vegas down the oh, street. Oh, like, like, that's just like the mega. Monaco goes down that, the streets, don't it? Yeah, that's, just, that's just next level gear. That's just like <sighs> mind blowing, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Oh, mate. That'd be f- oh, imagine all the lights and all that. And f- <sighs> they were saying, like, a few of them got interviewed about it, and they're like, oh, it's going to be distracting. Yeah, it will be, won't it? you be like, that It was Lewis Hamilton, your mate, who said. He'll be distracting yeah. going there. He's, he's, my, he's my lover. He's, oh, right, okay. <laughs> he left. Wow. I'm glad you're not on Mike Pinto. That is oh. disgusting. Yeah, it's <laughs> 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 fucking hell. We can't repeat what, we what can't repeat that. Can we bleep that anyway, editor? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you look over there There's a fairy editor <laughs> oh, was, it, was it Hamilton who said that though yeah That yeah, yeah. was going to be yeah and, uh, Yeah because uh, There's a clip as well From a few years back When they're just being interviewed And there was new ownership In F1 And uh, they said Oh just a question for you guys So they're on a panel You know in the news And they're like Oh what uh, What requests would you have To the new owners What would you say And uh, Dan Ricardo, the Aussie. That's why I got really into it because yeah, yeah. I watched the the Drive Survive series during lockdown, and that just made me go, "Fuck, this is great! I yeah. love it. it's drama." Everything. Also, you've only recently, yeah, in the last year, yeah, a bit, oh, yeah, yeah, okay. I love it, and uh, so much so, my missus got me a uh, laps around Silverstone, and I got in a little single seat. Like, wow, it was amazing. But anyway, oh, sick. Dan Ricardo was like, "Mate, Vegas," and then Hamilton was like, "Miami," and they've both now got tracks. Happening in the next year and a half. That's cool. Oh, that's yeah, yeah. So I feel enough. like people must have, there might have been a bit of, you know. Bribery. No, no. <laughs> you always go criminal <laughs> yeah. straight away. I feel like there might have been a bit of weight to what they said. Like people go, Ooh, oh, yeah, yeah, Hamilton yeah, yeah. and Ricardo want this. It could be pretty good. And that might have been a selling point. I reckon when the Vegas race takes off. Jamie's got an ad's mate, he's got to run over the coat. <laughs> run on throw, the track. Throw it over the track. Uh, Jamie, petrol. All right. <laughs> petrol prices. <laughs> oh, God. Petrol rights. <laughs> petrol prices. That's the opposite. <laughs> petrol rights. <laughs> we need more of it. <laughs> Keep burning it, baby. <laughs> yes, uh, that's, that's the way it's up a race, mate. Are you only into football, you two? No, a horse racing. Football. Well, it goes football, then I'd say tennis. Yeah. And snook- tennis? Yeah, then snooker. Oh, I like a bit of snooker. Oh, oh yeah. snooker. Yeah. Well, yeah. You, you happily sit there and watch snooker? I've, oh, been, yeah, live. Been, I've been live. I love snooker. You've been live? Ronnie, o- Ronnie O'Sullivan's the greatest sport of oh, all time. Oh, it's unbelievable. What? He's a mercurial genius. I've been to snooker live to watch Ronnie O'Sullivan because it's like... 
I have like, to, don't you? Before you, like, you have to see that greatness and on, I, on a table. It's here's unbelievable. How, here's how much of a narcissist I was, and part of the reason why I do stand up. I was trying to get my cough. I was coughing at key moments to watch it back on telly. I thought, That's yeah, my yeah, cough. Yeah. My cough's been on telly. <laughs> so if you were if you was watching Eurosport in two thousand and six, and you were a so was that you on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? <laughs> pretty. <laughs> Is that <laughs> <a> match <laughs> fixing again? Do you know that on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Yeah, the, oh. the fellow's coughing the answers. Yeah. Oh, I was just <clears> thinking, <throat> 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 Jamie. Yeah, I'm not trusting that cough. Thick <laughs> <laughs> cunt. Cop, don't hit the bloke. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I feel like that makes yeah. sense being in 06 because 0203 was when you were saying you were well. Yeah. And then 06 <laughs> is when you started declining, when you were coughing on <laughs> national yeah, television. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to the snookers. And I shook to a bookmaker's hand who I later went on to you go what? and work for. And I went, I just, I'm, you're a bookmaker. You what, I his book hand? It, shook his hand. Oh, sh- I thought you said you, you sucked. <laughs> shook his hand? You grabbed his hand, you sucked. I was like, is this some kind of weird initiation into the world of snooker? <laughs> for the fairies? I, I, well, I wanted to be a vampire, mate. so I thought I'll get a taste of it by uh, <laughs> sucking one of his scabs. <laughs> That's like... <laughs> Oh well, I just—it could have just been a finger, but you went <laughs> scab. Yeah, <laughs> scabs are bloody. Ah, oh, listen, oh, here, let's look, move on. I feel like yeah, let's just get. Uh, so doctors, I shook mate. his hand and I was like, oh, I'm, I was 15. And I was like, I just want to say, I'm like proper uh, admire what you've done for like gambling and stuff, because I was proper into gambling from a kid, <laughs> and I went on to work for him and get sacked from him. Right Wait, for your kid. <laughs> 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 Long tail, the long tail. <laughs> so every time you say rat now, yeah. we're going to have to do that, aren't we? Every single episode yeah, yeah, moving yeah. forward. Yeah, oh, that's amazing. Oh, anyone who don't sign up to the membership from now on is going to be referred to as a long tail. <laughs> yep. Yeah, so sign up, you fucking tail. long tails. Come and join the fairies on the good side. <laughs> don't, be getting, don't be getting us called the fairies now. <laughs> I'm, mate, I'm, 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 I'm a fairy. I'm happy, Lee. As I'm long as you're happy, Jamie. So I didn't realise, like, I didn't know what that meant in English terms. Fairy. fairy. Yeah. yeah, it's like, it's an old school sort of derogatory term for homosexual. Yeah. So when when you said there was happening with a fairy before, immediately in my head, I thought, because we're talking about America, I was thinking of, like, Princess Peach. <laughs> that you were saying fairy. Oh, no, I was calling him gay. <laughs> oh, right. Yeah. <laughs> Straight up, Tony. Just, Tony just, no, 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 no. Just to clarify, <laughs> no, no. we're calling... Lewis Hamilton, <laughs> gay. You've heard that he first exclusively on Hot Water's Green Room podcast. Lewis Hamilton, breaking news, is gay. And do you know why? Because when I kissed him, he closed his eyes. <laughs> Shout out Lewis Hamilton, you do a lot for this. It's not a bad thing. It's not. It's not. It's have not. I, have I, I haven't once said it's a bad thing. You know what? I'm, I'm glad he's happy and we're happy. I'll be honest with you, when I play Mario I, I'm either Princess Peach or Toadie. I like going... Um, Bowser. Bowser. Reminds me of myself, you know, big back. <laughs> Angry big sometimes. Back. And, 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 and he kidnaps women. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting cancelled, the alley. You can't cancel someone who doesn't give a fuck. Oh, Jesus he Christ. Women. He doesn't He doesn't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck, mate. I'm well, not in this for the long haul. If you were Bowser, though, I'd like to know what your castle would be like, Tony. Because you oh. you've got nightclubs, right? That's what I mean. I'm the king of the castle now. I've got a castle <laughs> myself now. Have you? Yeah. Fire pits and everything. Yeah. yeah. And loads of With those kidnapped women. With flaming things. <laughs> loads of kidnapped women. Women just tired loads of me shed. Loads of Venus fly traps. <laughs> and then there's, there's, fucking, there's always these, like, these fellas who, like... Um, what are they called? Um, what's Mario? Plumber. Plumber. There's all, there's all these. There's, <laughs> yeah, there's all these. Plum- so you trying to say plumber? There's all these <laughs> plumbers always fucking like trying to break into my house to get these women back. They saw coming through the pipes and that. Yeah, I'm like fuck off, man. Cutting you off. Oh, they could cut you off. He knows they're coming because he hears. As <laughs> 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 they go through the pipes. Oh, they were some good games then, wasn't they? Oh, that was right. fucking, that was peak game, innit? I'm so bad at games. Do you remember man. the, remember the, um, why, my, just, my, 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 I'm gone blank today. <laughs> what was it called? The, the console? The Nintendo 64. 64 yeah. Then, oh, yeah. that was just next level gaming. Yeah, 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 Golden Knight. And that. Yeah. <sighs> I've never completed a game. 
like a video game. Ever? Ever? No. What? No. No way. No, I'm so... I've got no coordination stuff. That's okay. why I used to make my own games up, because there's no completion. What, out in the yard? No, in the living room. I used to race playing cards and, you know... You used to race cards? Yeah. What do you like mean? Shuffle them across, and the first one to touch the skirting board won. Is, did you only have gambling equipment available in your house <laughs> yeah. to play with? Well, pretty much. It was all dice and cards. Yeah. yeah. You dice would be way better to race with. No, 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 no. Why? No. <laughs> what do you mean, no? <laughs> you fucking throw them. But the cards look regal. Regal. Yeah, you take the king of arts and show me you're better. You know, I'd love to be the king of arts. <laughs> Would you? Yeah, like a regal man of love. King of <laughs> <laughs> Jamie, I'm sorry, but you're a fucking spade. <laughs> That's the best thing I've ever heard. I'm sorry, Jamie, but you're a fucking spade. <laughs> oh, yes. That was oh. good. <laughs> oh, God. That's the best what? insult I've ever heard. <laughs> You're a fucking spade. <laughs> Excellent. And I feel like with all your gambling, that cut deep. Oh, that was so good. <laughs> it was great. <laughs> Fantastic. Uh, hearts are my favourite suit as well. <laughs> oh, oh God. Up. What's your yeah. favourite suit? Oh. Oh, actually... Mm. It's hard. I mean, diamonds. Diamond, yeah. Diamonds is good. Yeah, but I d- oh, clubs. Diamond, but you, I don't know. Do you play poker? Perfect. Diamond? Huh? Do you play poker? Yeah. What? What? Like Texas Hold'em? Yeah. Yeah. What, what would you if you had a flush? Because I love getting flushes, but you know, red red flush. You have to. Well, you want the one that wins. Yeah. No. But what if you had a preference, just aesthetically wise? I prefer a red flush because it reminds me of my mum's menopause. <laughs> Why? Why? I've had red flushes since Thursday as well because it's that much blood in the bowl. <laughs> Jesus what is wrong with you? <laughs> I genuinely. I said it gets more and more, Jamie. Oh, I'm, I need to ask you. When does you. it stop, though? Yeah, when does it stop? <laughs> yeah, I, I, I need to intervene and just... I, are you okay? Just Has anyone ever asked you that? I've not been Has anyone questions. ever asked you if you're all right? <laughs> too much I feel too. like every time we hang out, you're like, fuck it. Oh, yeah. Hey, Joe's a good... That reminds me. My mum's menopause. <laughs> fuck, I love that woman. And I, and not to mention, fuck me, you should have seen my bowl. Are you all right, bro? Yeah. yeah. I'm on the water. <laughs> this is you sober. <laughs> this is you in recovery. Oh, oh my God. <sighs> oh, as long as you're all right, mate. But oh. yeah, th- to answer your question, I think I think diamond flush. Red, definitely. Mm. Yeah. I always <laughs> was... All right. I, I think they're all equal. <laughs> what? <did it? laughs> what? Oh, God. You'd never win Texas... Hold them if you thought all the cards were the same. <laughs> I know that I've got some. three and a two and a seven. That is a flush. <laughs> <laughs> I love playing poker, man. Yeah. I, no, they're the games I, I used to play. I used to play, uh, yeah, I, I've actually, there was a poker game play. A poker game on PlayStation 2. Yeah. So you can like move up the rankings and stuff like that. So... I don't say it's a completion, but I used to play sports games right? and see myself as like a 16-year-old prodigy on them. Do you know what I mean? Like a tennis game and you build your way up to winning Wimbledon and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, okay. And that's how I carry it on in the shower now. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> so carry it on in the shower? Yeah. Have you heard this now? It yeah. has uh, fantasy showers. So I have like three showers a day, despite the look of a man. You have three showers a day? Yeah. but Why? Well, one to wash, one to just chill. But I have fantasy ones where I act out winning Wimbledon or act out winning Britain's Got Talent or whatever. You go in the shower to do it. Yeah, yeah. Because it just, 
you know, white noise of the water hitting you. And you have you talked about this before? Yeah, 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 yeah. A few times, yeah. but yeah. Right. yeah, it furnishes showers. Yeah, yeah man. I get it if you do it. Why does it have to be? Can't you just do that? But like he doesn't. So like, where, where do you? I will do it on the street as well. I've had horse races in the street. What? What do you mean? What with I, cops, horses as they walk past? <laughs> no, with other people, <laughs> with dogs, or horses. Oh, and then I'd say, say someone's ten yards in front of me, and there's a lamp post thirty yards in front of them. I'm going up the Cheltenham Hill, and I'm a horse, and he's a horse. And I'll do the commentary there. I'm going on that far side. And just give myself a little whip. And there we go. First one to win the... Give uh, yourself a To the uh, lamppost. So you whip yourself while so you... So you race as strangers in the streets. As, as horses. I'm going to intervene again. Are you yeah. okay? <laughs> it's great fun. I'm hurting. Why would I? As long like, as... Do you know what? I gamble so much that I <laughs> go out in the street... <laughs> And I look bet. at people and I bet on them <laughs> and I whip myself <laughs> to make sure I get ahead when they've got no interest in this game at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But they don't even know what's going on. They just see him just fucking running whip, past them whip him. himself. Yeah, fact, oh, I've been caught whipping myself by someone at work having a sick. Why, why are you in your own ass? What? I was in the horse race. Because I, 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 I worked... Someone's caught you whipping yourself. What are you whipping yourself with? Have you got like a little... Just a... Just a no, not with nothing in it, but I just like give myself a little G up and then I'll go faster. Right, okay. Just slightly break into a canter. Do you <laughs> know what I mean? Like a slightly faster walk. Do you do that? No, but do the commentary on that. I'm coming up on the far side. It's Hutch's pride. He's getting there with it's every Hutch's stride. Hutch's pride. Yeah. It's stride. Wow. Yeah. It, Hutch's pride would be the name yeah, of you. Yeah. If you were a horse. Uh, Hutch, ha- Hutch's pride or Bluebell. Blood Bluebell. Yeah. I don't know. I just like the name. I like, I like one word. Is that a type names. of cheese? No, it's Baby Bell. Baby Bell. Yeah, that's my daughter. <laughs> <laughs> you imagine if you named your daughter after cheese. What would you be, Tony, if you were a horse? Um, <laughs> what the fuck's that question? <laughs> what? You said put down. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Tony would be in the glue factory. Oh, oh Tony! <laughs> He's been rinsed oh, there. That's okay. Oh, I'll right. be red rum, I think. Cause we what? Red, red rum. Red rum. Yeah. Red rum. Baby Bell. No, Blue Bell. Blue Bell. Blue Bell. Hasn't he been a few red rums? No. Yeah, hasn't he? Red Bull. Red Bull. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, horse names do come in cycles, but yeah. there is. Red what rum, do you mean? No. Red really. rum was like a, 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 a like a famous horse. Won three Grand Nationals. Yeah. What are uh, you allowed to reuse their name? They don't retire mm, names. There is uh, there, must be a there, there, there is a rule on some names, like there's some famous names that won't really get named again. Yeah. I, I think that probably would be one of them. Maybe abroad. Do you know what I mean? If it wasn't a jump source, uh, like an uh, Aussie horses are always like fast. You know, it's all about sprinting. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so no. maybe in I that say yeah, but I have no fucking clue because it's a completely different sphere and stuff. The Grand Nationals next week. It is, mate. Snow Leopardess. I'm going as well. James tip oh, yeah. of the week. I'm going Ladies Day Friday. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I'm a ladies man. Yeah. All oh, right. I'm, unless it's Lewis Hamilton. Yeah. Well, you know, <laughs> that's only on Tuesdays. <laughs> you don't discriminate, do you? No. Oh. Uh, yeah, Snow Leopardess. I've got eighteen to one for it. Nice little horse, man. Yeah, so you gonna have a little okay. bet next week? Hey, you gonna have a little bet on the Grand National? I've never bet on a Grand National. I don't know. Well, let's change that. Let's do. Let's 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 pick a horse I'm for just you. Seeing what I'll, I'll take you under my wing if you want. Yeah, you, that's what I'm worried about. <laughs> <laughs> you'll do the one You'll frog. do one bet next week. <laughs> Come on, lad. <laughs> hey, you'll, you'll have one bet next week on the National, and you'll end up like Jamie. <laughs> I'll, I'll double your fee. Oh, bit worried. Shit and blood. <laughs> See, if you keep your head down, five years' time, you could be like me as yeah. well. Yeah, fucking. <laughs> wow. This is when, like, at the Chinese, when you were like, hey, yeah, yeah, we're the same. This yeah. is how it starts. Proper is the Grand thought. National. Uh, oh, pop, Tony, pop. I'm worried, mate. It's an entry I, drug. I think you shouldn't bet on a Grand National. No, I don't think so either. It, I'll watch what happens to you. It's an entry drug race. I was at the Shelton Festival a few weeks ago. I ended up five, six hundred quid up. So I'm actually good at horse racing, gambling. I just yeah, get, you tweet about it as well, don't you? I just get too giddy and then end up doing me bollocks in the casino or whatever. That's the problem with me. I can't stop once I start. 
with like with booze and everything really. and your blood and yeah. narcotics yeah <laughs> and uh stand up <laughs> and love and love yeah <laughs> what, what get easily Just attached get, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what a girl said hello to him a few weeks back and he opened the joint bank account with her. He what? A girl said hello to him. Oh, good show, Jamie. And he ended up opening the joint bank account with her. No, he didn't. No, nah, that was a lie. Oh, <laughs> was just, he believed it. Yeah, he <laughs> believed it. He, he was, believed it a few weeks ago, you know, when <laughs> Callum told that story we're not allowed to tell anymore. And he went, yeah, it was dead tight. You know, we, he met her on the night and he, he, yeah. he, he <laughs> Callum told him that he left the nightclub to phone his mum went, I've met a really nice girl. <laughs> and he believed, believed that it. I did it. <laughs> <laughs> he was like talking about I'm trying to introduce her to me mum. My first can't night. Don't I, story anymore. I don't know, it was just time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, so, yeah. yeah. She's sound. She's sound. Um right, on that note, shall we wrap things up? Uh, do we have to? Huh? Yeah. All <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. That's what you're addicted to this as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I haven't I've enjoyed this. It's yeah, been it's really good. good. Fact. It's been it good. was good. Right, you little long tails. Sign up to the <laughs> membership, three pound a month. <laughs> YouTube.com, hot water comedy. You know what to do. There's links in the description and all that. You help support us. You help keep me in fairy juice and gambling tokens. And also as well, we I might have to pay for Jamie's funeral cost soon if you know they keep shit in blood. So. I'd appreciate if you could help me out with the costs. Three quid. It's just three nights out in quids in. That's in nothing. Isle of Man. Yeah. Nothing, mate. Yeah. Um, and also as well, would you like to plug your social medias? Yeah, Thomas Green Comedy. Oh, and any shows coming up? Uh, just doing the tour and yeah. then uh, yeah, the clubs this year. And then, but I'm doing my first UK tour next oh. year. So. Last question. Best comedy club in the country? There's one in London I really like. <laughs> <laughs> Got me there. Got me. It's hot water, baby. <laughs> Open six days a week. Make sure you come down and, and support live comedy. I might be on. Who knows? Oh, actually, you know what? I'm going to go on tonight. Oh, sick. I'm, I'm going to jump gonna... on stage tonight. Oh, have I'm, a little rant. I'm going to get pissed now. I'm in, the mood. I'm in the mood for a beer now. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you perked up. Look what water does to you. I know. Yeah. Oh, that's should try this more. Shout out Volvic. The entry, great, uh, the entry drug to alcoholism. <laughs> Right. Uh, sweet. Thanks for coming, Thomas. Uh, go Thanks and check me. Thomas' videos out and say he's fucking genuinely one of the best comedians in the country's class. Thanks, mate. We'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.